Hello world, we are at the Myrtle Beach Pelicans baseball field for the first time ever. I've never been to one of these games. I didn't really watch baseball that much until the other day when I found out about my home team's uh, shindig and I've actually enjoyed minor league baseball here lately. So we come to Myrtle Beach quite often and I've never done this before. So I'm really excited to get in there. I'm going to show you guys a little bit of what it's like, but I'm also going to show you my experience so that you'll know what it's like if you want to come. So I normally wear a hat, especially in hot areas like this, so I definitely know I'm going to go to the merch store, try to find me a Pelican's hat, and uh, cover up this big old dome I've got upstairs here. Now, when we parked the car, there was no parking fee today. I don't know if that can change, but there wasn't any today. Now this baseball field is called two different names on Google Maps. I've heard TicketReturn.com Field, and I've heard Pelican's uh, ballpark. So I guess it's got two names. Somebody who goes here all the time, please help me out in the comments. If I was going here, what should I call it? Should I say, hey, we're going to TicketReturn.com Field? Or should I say we're going to Pelican's Ballpark? I don't know. Right at the front gates you can see this box office and we won't be using that because we bought our tickets online for about $15 a person. Um, we got family uh, in the family section today. And I can see before we even go in that they have a pretty big playground right here. Let's zoom in and get a little bit more of that. If you have young kids that got to get the wiggles out, that is very nice. We're going to make our way right past that box office and under this big old pelican right here. That is really cool. Tickets are scanned and we've got a bouncy house right there and a big old grill. We'll probably check that out today too because I haven't eaten yet and I am hungry. If you turn to the right here, we've got something called Hops Heaven. I guess there, oh yeah, look at this. I didn't say this, but the Myrtle Beach Pelicans are actually a single A affiliate of the Chicago Cubs. And they have like a little Wrigley Field, is that a grill? Yeah, Clark and Allison Grill right there. So that's kind of like a, a pretty cool sign that you see at Wrigley Field. Our very first look at ticketsreturn.com field and or Pelican Ballpark. <laughs> Let's go over here and check out the whole field. Oh, that was a strike by the Pelicans. This is a huge stadium field. Whatever you want to call it. Look at that. As they play the Dropkick Murphys, I figured I would go ahead and tell you that um, this little ball game going on right here, for whatever reason, we got a pr the $15 price got us into two baseball games. Whoa, there goes a fly ball. Foul ball. So it got us into two baseball games. However, we're just going to see the second one of those games because we were having fun on the beach today. First order of business with a two-year-old, though, is going to the restroom. So we're headed that way. Then I gotta find something to cover my radar dish forehead. And then we're gonna watch a fun baseball game. Look at these, these like little concessions for alcohol and things. On the way to the bathroom, I found Windy City Wieners. You always have to have a, a hot dog at a baseball game, don't you? It's just, it tastes so good. It's like a better hot dog when you eat it at a baseball game. Here's what Windy City Wieners has. Bathroom situation is completed. We're gonna go into the pro shop here. Give it a look-see. There's my hats over here. There's a lot of hats, holy cow. Let's start over here first. They're kind of cool. Kind of like a little bit more structured in my hat, you know. Like I don't like the floppiness. Wow, I kind of like this one right here. You have these, more like a baseball cap. Flat bill and curved. Here's a quick tour of the shirts, too. I kind of like this one. 
Because it has the Chicago Cubs on there too. Yeah. That's a nice one right there. And then they have the jerseys hanging here. They're $90. Kind of cool. Got like a silky material, so not too hot. There we go. How do you like the hat? I love it. Now look what I'm looking at. Wow, there's a lot of kids out there. Look at that guy. <laughs> hey. <laughs> guy was super nice. He told my daughter that since it's the first time she's been here, she gets some sort of a certificate or something. I think our seats are up here in that family fun zone. Which ones are they? Oh, well, we'll just head up and figure it out later. And that is going to be our view for row D 10, 11, and 12. Not a bad view at all. Now I want to point something out. This happened at my home park too. You see all the shade right here in the higher up seats? This is the evening. And the closer the seats are, the less shade you're going to have. So once that sun sets, you might want to be up here in the higher seats, like we are, to get some shade. It still just cracks me up that they have the Wrigley Field sign right there. She is ordering her food right now. So all I should have to do is go up there and pick it up. Maybe pay for it, or are you going to pay for it on there? I don't know yet. Okay, well we're going to wing it. Now I just talked about the shade earlier, and I wanted to point out that there is more shade on the Wrigley Field concession stand area. It's Flash! The Pelican. And he's getting it done. Says I'm only here for the dog. So what do you do as a dad when you sit down and you get super comfortable? Well, you go get food, so it's time to go eat that. Onward we go to the great food area to get greasy hot dogs and baseball food. That stuff hits right here at baseball field, right? A good old hot dog just hits right. to go. I think she said home plate though. I'm going to have to text her and figure it out. Oh, here it is. Home plate. Yeah. So these little restaurants are named differently. We just ordered on our phone and I'm supposed to pick it up from the home plate place. So let's see how this works. While I'm waiting on my mobile order, let's check out this uh, menu here with all the prices. You can pause the video and see if your favorite food's on there and how much it is and it's stiff big suggestion do not use mobile order they didn't really know what it was and it took a long time to get our food I don't really I mean lots of weird things happened during that but here's what I got I got pizza and a hot dog and this souvenir cup here that's pretty cool right food was pretty good I mean it's baseball park food I wouldn't say it's like a four course meal or anything like that it was all right now let's watch some baseball. Oh, dang. Though while I was eating, they got two runs in. So we're up 2-0 right now. Go Falcons! Ticketreturn.com field. I guess that's what it's called. It's free t-shirt time and we caught one. We got some chili on it somewhere. Yeah, right here. Yeah. 
have. Free t-shirt. What's the back like? It says it's cool. I failed to mention that we are playing the Delmarva Shorebirds. So it's Pelicans versus the Shorebirds right now, and they just got a run in. So it is 2-1. Got him off the field. So the Pelicans are coming up to bat next. Here's a little look at the dugout. Headed into the fifth. We are all tied up at 2-2. Two -two. Sing, take me out to the ball game, and that usually happens during the seventh inning. So why did it happen before the fifth inning? Well, because it's a doubleheader today, so these games only last until seven innings. So they're cut a little bit short, but that's fine for us because we have a little one. Everybody, clap your hands on there. Yeah. They just walked us in for a run, and that's good because it is now three to two, not two to two. So it broke the tie. Thanks for that. They just gave us a freebie again. It is now four to two. Just running them in left and right. Look at the score. Five to two, seven to two. Now we got two more. All kinds of mistakes coming out here. The Shorebirds, I mean, literally ran the score up on them. It is eight to two right now due to like stealing bases and dropped balls and things. This has been crazy. Two strikes. Let's hope it's a strike. Oh, it's a foul. Bleh. It is 
is the final score of Pelicans 12, Shorebirds 2. Here at TicketReturn.com Field. We're going to do a victory lap! Yeah, oh! Took a shortcut! Forget first base. We're over third, first base. Guess there weren't any treats over there. Some work, puppy. We're headed out, and I have to get one more shot of this Wrigley Field sign right here. I think it's so cool. I'd love to go to Wrigley Field in real life, but this is what we're gonna have to deal with for now: the uh, Wrigley Field sign at the Myrtle Beach Pelicans Field. So we're headed out of the car, and I guess I'll close out the video. Oh, there's Splash. And with that, that wraps our journey up for my very first. Myrtle Beach Pelicans game. I definitely think it's one of the most fun things to do here at Myrtle Beach. I had a blast, got me this cool hat. They won by like a bajillion. It was a really super good time. And for 15 bucks a person, that's what we pay currently. I don't think it's a bad deal. I definitely think I would come back here again and enjoy this baseball game. So minor league games are so much fun, y'all. It gives you this kind of small town feel. Like people are very nice that work there. You know, it's just a fun atmosphere. I, can, I really can't suggest it enough. So if you're out here at Myrtle Beach, South Carolina, come over here and check them out. Because I definitely will again whenever I come back here next time. So thank you all for watching. I had fun and thanks for playing. Bye.